Hey guys, we are going to be doing two chapters today, but each on separate videos, or else it'll take up too much of my gig. Today we're going to be doing chapter five, the family line of Adam. Here's the written story of Adam's family line. When God created man, he made them in his own likeness. He created them as male and female. He blessed them, and he called them man when they were created. When Adam was 130 years old, he had his son in his own likeness. He named him Seth. Adam lived over 800 years after Seth was born. He had also so had other sons and daughters. Adam lived a total of 930 years. Then he died. Seth lived 105 years. Then he became the father of Enosh. Seth lived 807 years after Enosh was born. He lived. He had other sons and daughters. Seth lived a total of 912 years. Then he died. Enosh lived 90 years. Then he became the father, father of Kenan. Enosh lived 850 years after Kenan was born. He lived. Uh, he had other sons and daughters. Enosh lived a total of 905 years. Then he died. Kenan lived 70 years. Then he became the father of Mahilo. Kenan lived 804 years after Ken Mahilo was born. He also had other sons and daughters. Kenan lived a total of 910 years. Then he died. Mah Mahilo lived 65 years. Then he, be then he became the father of Jared. Mahilo lived 830 years after Jared was born. He also lived with other sons and daughters. Mahilo lived a total of 895 years. Then he died. Jared lived 162 years. Then became the father of Enoch. Jared lived 800 years after Enoch was born. He had also other sons and daughters. Jared lived a total of 962 years. Then he died. Enoch lived 65 years. Then he became the father of Mithila. Enoch walked his walked with God 300 years after Milosh was born. He had also had other sons and daughters. Enoch lived a total of 365 years. Enoch walked with God, then he couldn't be found because God took him from his life. In other words, he died. Methuselah lived 187 years. Then he, then he became the father of Lamech. Methuselah lived 780 years after Lamech was born. He had also other sons and daughters. Methuselah lived a total of 969 years. Then he died. Lamech lived 180 years. Then he had a son. He named him Noah. And Lamech said, He will comfort us when we are working. He will comfort us when our hands work so they are hard to hurt. We will have to work hard because the Lord God had put a curse on the ground. Lamech lived 595 years after Noah was born. He had other sons and daughters. Lamech lived a total of the lucky sevens, in other words, 777 years. Then he died. After Noah was 500 years old, he became the father of Shem, Ham, and Japheth. That's chapter 5, everybody. Please subscribe and like my videos. Tell them to other people so they can also learn about God.